Hello and welcome again to our YouTube channel. In today's video from the Photoshop series, we are going to see a quick trick, which is how to rotate this nice pendulum around its hanging uh, point. The information or the trick is in the toggling reference points. So simply how to find the toggling reference point of any shape. You can see this uh, small round circle. Uh, that's the toggling reference point or the default toggling reference point, which is the intersection of the box that's surrounding the shape, that are its diagonals. So the diagonal coming here and the one diagonal is coming here and this it's inter intersection that's the toggling point so if i make control t which is the free transformation you will find this nice menu on the top here uh, on the top left you will find uh, this check mark if i dimmed it you will not you will find that this circle uh, disappeared this circle was the uh, toggling reference point if i checked it again you will find that these nine squares are not dimmed anymore and then you can select one of these nine points as a uh, toggling reference these nine points are marked with white squares here and it is and the ninth one is the central one which is the default if i need to change the uh, rotation to the top point like this one you can see that the circle is moved here if i come to the angle and i make 30 it's rotating 30 degrees if i make it minus 30 it's rotating completely in the opposite direction so I'm going to turn it to zero again, just uh, in the middle. Now, if you like to uh, make a, a nice GIF of uh, a swinging pendulum, simply uh, you are going to this layer to rasterize it. So I just I need to click enter twice. Okay, rasterize, uh, sorry, smart objects, convert to smart object. Now I have it smart object, so I can make its transformation on a timeline. Then I go to window, timeline. Okay, that's uh, our selection selected, which is uh, our pendant here. Uh, control zero to make it appearing in the area on the top uh, okay and then i return my pointer keyframe to make sure that it is in the very beginning if you unfold this menu small menu for the timeline you will find here the first thing is the transformation i need to make it to transform it between the complete uh, swings of the of my screen so my first position i'll make it control t and then i will select an angle. just i need to make sure that the hang the rotate the toggle reference point is the hanging point and then I make the angle here at 30 degrees. I click enter twice. Okay, now it is final. And then I make transform. So it's fixed this uh, position. I will drag uh, my pointer or I click here, then go to time. And then I make my time just in the middle because this is five second frame, which is by default generated by Photoshop. So I make this one two and I make this one 15. So just it's coming exactly in the middle and on the middle i make control t again and i change uh, the, i make sure that the hanging uh, point is selected i change the angle to minus 30 degrees so it is completely in the right i click enter twice then this point is marked then i drag to the end frame okay and then control t again i return it back to 30 degrees which is my original start point Control Z, I made it a mistake because I didn't change the hanging point. I changed the hanging point here. And then simply like this, it's turning again. Enter twice, your video or your video timeline is created. You can just play it now. And you can see your pendulum is hanging, is uh, is rotating freely in, uh, in a very nice manner. I hope this trick will be nice. You can use it in your uh, on your website in your coming uh, uh, illustrations and uh, coming videos uh, join our channel activate the bell let me see you in coming videos and follow our uh, web we have details for all these tutorials on our web in step by step thank you for following so far